But that's my point. This is exactly why I'm not about to be like, all right. So on this day, July the 1st, we fell out because she didn't put enough icing on my cupcake. Y'all, I'm not doing it. You get what I'm saying? I don't have to up there. And it's fine that you don't want to tell your business. I wouldn't tell mine either. Period. Or I can give you the base. The base is retrograde. I'm not playing with y'all. <laughs> I was dead serious. You know what I'm saying? This stupid B click baiting me. I'm pissed. I'm not even going to sleep tonight. Nick got me so freaking mad. Oh my God, I could just choke her out and kill her through the camera. Anybody that got a hate comment, put it in the damn pin comment, please. I'm begging you, please. Royal League of Assassins. I will meet y'all in the pin comment. I was sent back on my mission. I didn't follow intuition. Back then I didn't wanna listen. But now I'm gunning for redemption. I want redemption. I want it. I got it. I want redemption. Don't get so for those who don't know, yesterday I did a video saying um why did me and my ex break up? Or uh yeah, why did we break up, right? And supposedly, this was a clickbait video. But see, to me, this wasn't a clickbait video. So here's the thing: at this point, doing clickbait, um, uh, anything that, whatever length I have to go to entertain you, I'm willing to go, right? Because obviously, you know, YouTube is acting weird. So, you know, what I'm saying I can't, I can't do the things that I used to do. So a lot of people are saying, you know, not even a lot, just some people, you know, you born, you used to be this, you used to be that. I know what I used to be, but you, but people change, you know what I'm saying? No, nobody really care about drama like that anymore, to be honest with you. You know, it, it don't, it's not good for your lifestyle, to be honest, even when you just talking about people, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to be like Wendy Williams, you know, I don't, I don't want to be like, None of them to talk bad about people. I always wanted to talk good about people. That's the difference between me and others. So, I'm I'm switching the channel how uh, I I need to. But not only that, YouTube is forcing me to. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I'm going to read some hate comments. Um, and some comments in general that people had on, on the subject of me and Jadea breaking up. Now... The thing is, retrograde is real. So, how that was clickbait? Mm -hmm. Maybe because I was being comical? Cool. But retrograde is very serious. And if you don't know what it is, I encourage you to go look at it. Now, although I don't know the exact definition of retrograde, I tell you what I feel. <laughs> I feel it. The first time it came around, Nick actually wrote a clip. Damn, I might get emotional. When y'all were watching <clears throat> Damo and Chrissy, y'all were like, how can you cry and be emotional when you're breaking up with a person? This has to be fake and all this shit. And it's like, bro, <laughs> have you ever heard of loving somebody so much that you have to let them go? <laughs> Sit down and don't cry. You're loving somebody so much. That you have to let them go. If you're not happy within, if you're not happy, I love you, Jadea. I don't even know if you're gonna watch this, but I love you. But I love you enough to let you go. Crying my eyes out. I was feeling all, I was feeling crazy as hell. Not even gonna lie to you, the first time retrograde came around. And this time, it's the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Except I don't feel so emotional. I just, I'm, I'm getting a feeling of, I wanna be free. I wanna live my life. I wanna learn new things. I wanna grow. And not saying that anybody's holding me back, but sometimes it takes separation to, to elevate, period. That don't mean you got beef with somebody. That don't mean you 
dislike somebody. You know what I'm saying? That don't mean you hate anybody. The fuck? <laughs> so anyway, I'm not going to say these names. Well, matter of fact, I am going to put the, um, nah, I'm not putting the comments on the screen. I'm going to put them on my thumbnail. So somebody who hates me so bad. Who gives a F about retrograde? Neek, stop the BS clickbait video just like the last one you made on this subject. So the last one I made on this subject wasn't a clickbait neither. We actually broke up. Now, the fact that you wanted me to say we broke up because uh, she did this to me and she did that to me, you're not going to get it. You get what I'm saying? It's obvious some people want me to slander other people, and I ain't doing it. You know what I'm saying? Anything that I say... In a breakup, people gonna feel some type of way. Why? Why people don't get that? <laughs> you gonna take one thing that I say, escalate it, and turn it into something else? Why would I tell you? Why would I tell you the exact reason? The like, like for me, retrograde was really 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 fucking with me <laughs> but not only that emotionally it caused issues you know what i'm saying so emotionally when you have issues with yourself you tend to fall out with other people especially the person you're in a relationship with so things happen why would i break down everything that i'm not doing that you know what i'm saying um, this is the, uh, that same person that's just a whole live, just, just so mad. Don't tell me this B-I-T-C-H about to do the same thing she did in the first video she made about this. She gonna keep saying, I'm gonna get to it, ramble about a bunch of BS and never say why they broke up. Stupid A. They ain't asking how you met. They asking why you broke up. There's a difference. So, this is my question to you. Why are you so mad? <laughs> like, understand after I read your, your comment, I went straight to sleep. I'm talking about like this. You know what I'm saying? Woke up and was like, yeah, let's go get some tacos. It's Tuesday. You didn't offend me. You don't offend me you get what i'm saying why you so mad that's a personal issue that you got going on you get what i'm saying for real like it's deep down in your soul you need to fix it but i'm i'm gonna keep you please put your comment in the pin comment this video please i'm i'm begging you anybody that has a hate comment put it in the pin comment that's the only way it's gonna get responded to I'll tell you that right now uh, somebody said, I don't think it was retrograde or about titles. You live together, work together, and hustle together. That's good, but 24-7 every day, all day, can lead to relationship problems. You need an aspect of your life to be independent of the other. I think you love each other, and as long as you maintain respect, you will find your way back to each other, and it will be stronger. Now that makes sense. Her opinion on, I don't think it's the, uh, I don't think it's retrograde. Okay, what do you think it is? Y'all work together, eat together, live together, talk together, what's together all the time. That makes sense to me. That wasn't rude. She ain't mad. I think her life is quite right. <laughs> wow, really, Neek? Now, you blew me with this one. I done drew a blank line, but I'm going with this is the clickbaiting you was talking about, huh? I ain't clickbait you. My reason is retrograde. Retrograde led to emotional uh, issues that I'm not gonna state. But retrograde was the main reason for me. It wasn't clickbait, baby. You get what I'm saying? But don't be so upset. Okay, next. Why can't y'all just not be? Why, why can't you? Why can't y'all just not be meant to 
be together. In my experience, it's not the title, it's the dynamic that develops over long-term relationships anyway. I'm happy for y'all. Thank you. So, you know, after I made the video, me and Jay spoke briefly. She said that she she feel like retrograde is child. People go through things, you know, differently. You know what I'm saying? And I'm standing on what the hell I'm saying. Like, y'all, people don't know what the hell people are really feeling. Not only that, I'm human, man. So all this, uh, there's no way YouTubers break up this month. Sure. Why so many YouTubers break up this year? Or we human. What are you talking about? Didn't you and your ex-girlfriend just break up a couple months ago? Did you go to the internet to tell everybody why you and your ex-girlfriend broke up a couple months ago? Did you? And if you did, you're crazy. It's just like I told y'all. Y'all my family, right? So, I come to y'all and I'm like, yo, we broke up because she ain't put enough ketchup on my hot dog today, bro. I'm pissed. And y'all don't need to talk to her no more. Guess what? Y'all will literally go to her and be like, bro, first of all, all Nick wanted was a hot dog. All you had to do was put more ketchup, but no. <laughs> <laughs> no, you want to be the rude little bee and not put enough ketchup on her hot dog. You get what I'm saying? People will actually be mad about that, bro. Like what? All Nick wanted was extra ketchup, and you ain't gonna put extra ketchup on her hot dog, bro. That are you? Like I'm dead serious. I told people, which was the truth, that me and Jadid cheated on our ex girlfriends. To be with each other, right? So somebody made a comment, which was very comical to me. I'm a fan. First of all, I don't do fans. We don't have fans. Ain't no fans. I ain't never had a fan in my life. The only fan I got is the one in my room that keeps me uh uh at temperature at night. You know what I'm saying? A good temperature. Okay, so I know. You don't support me for real because we ain't we ain't no fans over here. I'm a fan, but you have contradicted yourself. You said she cheated, so you did. No. I never said she cheated. I never said I cheated on each other. I cheated on my ex. She cheated on her ex. Is what we did. <laughs> <laughs> I cheated on my ex for Jadid. Jadid cheated on her ex for me because they was cheating on us separately. Her girlfriend was out doing her thing. My girlfriend was out doing her thing. We knew they was cheating on us. So we started cheating on them, right? Okay, I'm not done. But on one of your pranks, when she said she was cheating, which you first finding out via prank, you was about to throw her out, remember? So why not throw her out instead of doing the same? I'm just asking. It's bad enough. Straight. Straight. Think all gays and lesbians just sleep about. See where I'm coming from. No, see where I'm Como G from. I'm a fan of J2. You two are a good team. It shows. So first of all, this wasn't even a hate comment. I just think you're confused. A prank is a prank. Because you do know at the end of the prank, we say, it's a prank. It wasn't real. So... Her saying she cheated on me or whatever the prank was. I found out it was a prank. She found out it was a prank. Ha, ha, ha. We moved on. You go. You get what I'm saying? If I found out Jadid cheated on me, it wouldn't be through a prank. You know what I'm saying? And I never threw her out. So, but that's my point. This is exactly why I'm not about to be like, all right. So, on this day, July the 1st, we fell out. Because she didn't put enough icing on my cupcake. Y'all, I'm not doing it. You get what I'm saying? I don't have to. But you think I'm bullshitting about this retrograde, and I'm not. I'm dead serious about this retrograde. I'm dead serious. But shout out to the people who who, who have common sense. You know what I'm saying? Like, girl, you don't need to explain anything. What people don't know won't hurt them. <laughs> YouTubers only have so much privacy because they choose to put their lives out there. And it's fine that you don't want to tell your business. I wouldn't tell mine either. Period. Or I can give you the base. The base is retrograde. I'm not playing with y'all. 
<laughs> I was dead serious. You know what I'm saying? I was dead serious, and you still don't have to think I'm serious. I don't, I don't, I don't care. You know what I'm saying? Also, with the labels, I don't feel like you need to have a label in order to be in a a a a, a bind with someone or, or or have a bond with someone. I don't feel like you have to have a title for that. Titles tear up everything. Now, if you wanna um make rules on 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 what should be done in the process of you not having titles cool but even with titles people cheat people go beyond the title people break the title people divorcing every day b you know what i'm saying i was just talking to a girl yesterday about how she was divorcing her husband because he cheated on her three times and now she messing with a girl like oh they're bad okay they were in a title which was a marriage and then they got married and and now they got a divorce and pay a fifteen hundred dollar lawyer to uh uh to divorce them and all that extra yo titles don't matter to me man if you really rocking with me you really rocking with me and if you not you really not you know what i'm saying but that title won't make it no different it won't make it no different you know what i'm saying so how people feel you know what i'm saying about me not telling you to the T about why we broke up. But well, that's on you. But I told you. And I'm not playing. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Retrograde is very serious to me. Retrograde got everybody emotional out here. You know what I'm saying? Look it up. Y'all even emotional right now because I didn't tell you <laughs> the the down to the T why me and Jadia broke up. Mad as hell. This stupid B clickbait in me, I'm pissed. I'm not even going to sleep tonight. Nick got me so freaking mad. Oh my God, I could just choke her out and kill her through the camera. <laughs> Did I do that? Or, or is that on you? Because if clickbait, even if that were a clickbaited video, which it wasn't, by the way, um, if it was, the fact that that makes you so angry, it's a problem, man. That's a problem. Do you hear me? But shout out to the real royal assassins who always got my back a hundred percent. A hundred percent. I know who you are. You shine like a light. When I start making my own vid when I start making my own videos, that's when all the hate come. I get the most hate when I make my own videos. <clears throat> or when I react to Queen of Clarence, God knows. Um, and it's just like cool. Let the hate come. It is what it is. But the real Royal League of Assassins I already know what it is. Y'all know what it is. I appreciate y'all so much. I'm talking to the real Royal League of Assassins. The family. The family, bruh. Y'all know what it is. I appreciate y'all so much. Anybody that got a hate comment, put it in the damn pin comment, please. I'm begging you, please. Royal League of Assassins, I will meet y'all in the pin comment along with these haters. You get what I'm saying? I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. Look out for more videos from me that'll just be about me. Let's see how this goes. And um, I'm going to do a shoe collection video next. Y'all give me some ideas on what y'all want to see me do by myself. No reactions. Just me by myself. My reactions are going to be on Royal Reacts. I'm standing on it and that's what I'm doing. <laughs> okay? So go over there for those. This channel going to be about me. So, I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. We on to the next video. Peace out. Are you looking to get your shirt printed by Nick G the host? And not only get your shirt printed, get the fattest, the best, the baddest logo in the world. And that's royalty apparel. And you can get it from me. Yes, me. I do everything. I print out the logo. I cut the logo. I pick the logo. I also make sure it's measured right so it won't be crooked on your shirt. Then I press it down. Okay, one, two, three, pop open. 
then you got the best logo out in the world, okay? And I gotta make sure that it's on correctly. Not only that, I gotta ship it. So I make sure it's on there, heat and press right. Then I make sure it's folded right. Package it right. Okay, okay. Then you gotta close it so it can get to you on time, you know what I'm saying? Then I put my P.O. box on a paper and I send it to your door. Let me know if you want your shirt printed. Go visit royaltiesworld.bigcartel.com and go get your shirt today. Peace out.